It's pretty close. Mm -hmm. Ansari was ahead by 42 votes heading into the recount. And today, the results confirm she won by 39 votes. Ansari said this recount should reassure voters about our election process. Former Phoenix Vice Mayor Yasmin Ansari celebrating today after clinching the Democratic nomination for Congressional District 3. The tight race coming down to just 39 votes after a recount. It's the product of a lot of work. It's the product of more than 165,000 doors that were knocked across this district in the extreme Arizona summer heat, in the pouring rain of monsoon season. State law requires an automatic recount if the margin between the candidates is 5% or less. Jennifer Lewer with the County Elections Department said the recount process started on Monday after the Board of Supervisors certified the results of the primary last month. We bring the ballots um, that were counted with the first election to ensure that they were counted appropriately, that everything has been tracked appropriately, um, and to double check the numbers because the race is so close. Ansari now virtually securing her seat in Congress in the safe, deep blue district, currently held by Ruben Gallego, who is now running for Senate. Raquel Tehran said she reached out to Ansari, congratulating her. In a statement, she added that she is now committed to ensuring Democrats work together to elect Democrats up and down the ballot. A long campaign and a contentious race, I really, really hope to come together to work um, with my former opponents and with the entire community to unite our party towards November. And Ansari will face Republican Jeff Zink in the general election in November, guys.